Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, I posted a video on how to enable LSA protection on Windows 11. And my whole reason for posting that video was um, because for many users, including myself, if we head over to the Windows Security app, Device Security Core Isolation, LSA Protection, which stands for Local Security Authority Protection, was turning itself off. And this was a bug. And um, LSA Protection is basically a extra layer of security uh, for Windows 11 and is enabled by default. So it was a very strange bug where um, after the Patch Tuesday updates was turning itself off. And I'll leave a link to that video in the description as it will just provide you with a whole lot more info. Now, just to let you know that Microsoft has now officially confirmed this as a known issue over on their health dashboard as of the 21st of March, with Microsoft confirming now that um, it was caused by a Microsoft Defender antivirus anti-malware platform update that rolled out with the Patch Tuesday updates on the 15th of March last week. So if we head over to our Windows Update Update History Definition Updates, this was the antivirus, um, anti-malware platform that caused the problem. KB5007651 and the version was 1.0.2302.21002. So that was the antivirus, anti-malware platform update and version that started causing the issues according to Microsoft. Which by the way, this update would have been downloaded and installed automatically onto your device like all of the um, security updates do roll out for Windows 11. Now, um, if you did experience the issue, um, the workaround, as I did touch briefly on last week, um, is to basically turn on the LSA protection if it's turned off. If you see a warning, basically, um, you must dismiss that warning and then you need to restart your device and that should solve the problem. And Microsoft has officially now said that the workaround is this. Um, if you have enabled LSA protection and have restarted your device at least once, you can dismiss warning notifications and ignore any additional notifications prompting for a restart, as I did mention. So just to recap that again, so you need to turn LSA protection back on, dismiss any warnings, restart your device, and if there are still any more warnings, just dismiss that and your device will still be on, which means LSA protection has been enabled and is working and everything is correct. But that is just a bug. So um, um, Microsoft says that they are working on a re resolution and will provide an update as soon as possible. So there is no official fix. That is the only workaround at this stage. Turn it on, dismiss any warnings, restart your device. If there's still any warnings, dismiss those and uh, um, is affecting Windows 11 versions 22H2 and 21H2. And um, obviously that resolution, we hope, rolls out sooner than later, which Microsoft says they are working on. And when that does become available regarding um, the local security authority protection turning itself off, then I will post and let you know as soon as. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.